This is the fifth lecture in our first section, Foundations of Whole Numbers. Today we're going to round whole numbers. Another word for rounding is estimating. And this is something that you, you do a lot and you probably don't even think about it. And the example I'm going to use first is the population of the Earth that we used on the first, I'm gonna use the same number, but I know it's changed since then, since it was a few days ago. If somebody asks you, what is the population of the earth? You're most likely not gonna turn around and answer 7,406,849,068. No, what you're gonna do is you're going to round this number and say, oh, it's about 7 billion. Or you might even get a little more accurate and say 7,400,000,000. And what we just did was we rounded that. So let's, let's take a look at what we're doing when we round visually. So let's say this is way out on the number line. And let's just say we're gonna to round to the nearest 100 billion, okay? So that means that this would be 7,400,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,
by one. Then change the digits to the right to zero. For example, the speed of light is 186,474 close, somewhere around there, 186,000 miles per second. Actually, so let's round this to the nearest 100,000. Okay, so we find the place, we find the digit that we're rounding to. So we're rounding to the hundred thousands and we look at the digit to the right. It is greater than or equal to five. It's eight. Eight is greater than or equal to five. So we replace all these digits with zeros and we increase this one by one. So rounded that to the nearest hundred thousand would be 200,000 miles per second. And just, just for the record, this is not the speed of light exactly. It is right around 186,000 miles per second. But I just threw these digits out there for the purpose of this video. Okay, so that's going to do it for rounding whole numbers. We will see you in the next video, which will be some exercises rounding numbers. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.